Hey guys, I'm here for Phone Radar and this is the Samsung Gear VR. Now this is a VR kit from Oculus which has been partnered with the brand Samsung and they have launched their own model called as Gear VR. I had experienced this at uh, the Vegas that's at the CES event last year and uh, this is what it offers with. Again, this is compatible with the Note 5, the S6 Edge plus the S6 and the S6 Edge. You can check out the compatibility on samsung.com and it offers you with a cinematic video wide view and immersive 360 degree experience and realistic VR games. So this is what all you get within this. Again, there is uh, very less other information about the pricing which I have because it's under embargo. And let's open up the package and first show you what all comes within the same. So here within the first look, here is the actual kit. So this is the first uh, Gear VR's the main primary kit which is where you can place your phone. I'll just show you that later on. I'll first show you what else comes within the same. So here you have the the gaming starter guide and the Samsung Gear VR health and safety and warranty guide and this is how you can actually start using it. So I'll just place this also aside and show you what all comes within the package itself. So here first off you can uh, notice that it comes with these two straps. Let's open them up and here is the strap which goes actually on the back it's pretty long and then there's this uh, secondary strap again this is being sold in the us right now at a price of 99 us dollars so this is available on amazon best buy and few other stores so that can clearly give you an idea about the pricing or you can just wait for the announcement it's going to happen on 21st so first off you need to just lock this thing here just bend this and lock it here and you're done now this comes onto the top while here is the front part let's remove this protective film and it does have branding of samsung mentioned here and uh, you don't really need this at the moment you just have to place the phone so here is the phone which you have this is the samsung galaxy note 5 and uh, it has a software update let me just skip that and this is what it is so we just have to place the phone here and this is where it actually would uh, charge the phone so if you notice clearly there's this small port here where you can insert it and then welcome to your samsung gear vr to start the setup process remove your mobile device and install the required applications on it so the moment you insert this stuff, uh, it would start the, I mean it would voice activate the product itself. So we are done, we have saved up everything and uh, here are the lenses through which I would be looking through. So let me just configure everything and here is also the configuration button here. And on the side you have this uh, trackpad kind of options while uh, this is the button and this is back button so let me just start using it for a minute and then get back to you so before you set it up you would uh, notice that it would sh uh, show you that you need to install the gear VR software and once you do that it would install the gear VR video the VR gallery app manager oculus and the oculus home application a total size of 114 mb which would be installed onto your phone now once you do that you will have again sync this back onto your unit and then start using it and you can also find out uh, the small port which I had mentioned about earlier which would charge the device and also sync it with the same so the small port which would actually sync with the same and uh, keep you connected for the complete experience while on the device itself there is this uh, game we have branding powered by oculus and uh, here are the buttons which I mentioned about earlier and you get this customizable uh, strap kind of thing which you can wear based on your adjustment or how you would like to wear it so let's wait for this to complete and then directly take you uh, to the Gear VR application. Welcome to your Samsung Gear VR. To start the setup process, remove your mobile device and install the required applications on it. So this is what it says. Let's. Once you install the Oculus application, you would be asked to sign up following which you would get these options where you can install different uh, applications like these are the different VR apps like 360 video photos, the Oculus video, you have the uh, Circuit Solial which is a uh, performance which happens in Vegas and there are a few other applications. So let's proceed with the option of install apps. 
and this would take another 8 MB. So I have been installing a bunch of different applications. First was a 2 MB app, then followed by the 114 MB of Oculus, which took a lot of time to install. And now we have another application, which is of uh, 8 MB. That's again the size for installing these uh, default applications, which you have to compulsorily install. Let's wait for this to be done following which we'll start using is meanwhile let me talk about the product itself it's pretty convenient and if you look at this device itself it's pretty soft when compared to the google cardboard it's a complete setup kind of thing which can give you a good experience like if you're watching a complete movie and there's nothing which you will have to charge here this would just sync it with your device and it will understand if you're seeing your phone or not so here meanwhile you can notice that it's separately going to take a lot of time to install all these applications. So let's wait for a while and then let me take you back once all these applications are installed onto the Oculus VR. And we are ready to go. It says that you just have to insert this into your Gear VR headset or you can browse the Oculus Store for more applications. Again, to that you'll have to insert, uh, add your credit card details. So let's skip that. Let's just run the app option and uh, that's the application and uh, directly take you back. To how you can proceed with so here you can also find all the different applications which you can actually purchase so these are some of the must-have applications and new releases so let's proceed with the setup so here you just have to insert this into this micro usb slot and once you do that you will notice that there is an uh, notification which says that you have inserted this now next thing is that you have to just you have to just close this kit and then start using it so here is how you need to wear this thing and once you have wore it, if you feel comfortable, you are ready to go. So right now I am watching some uh, 360 photos which is available through the gallery. Again all the notification options and all the control options are here. If you notice there is this back button here and a few swipe options like you can swipe up, down and a few other actions. And let's start enjoying the experience. So this is how it works. It's pretty neat and uh, Obviously, it's a great experience, I would say, at least if I start watching some kind of videos. So right now, I'm watching, experiencing the 360 photos application. So let's go back and uh, go to some other application. And here we go. So I just started using this Oculus uh, around uh, 10 minutes back. So that's around 10 minutes of usage. Let's check the battery. It was at 21% earlier and now the battery is at 15%. I guess it's not even 10 minutes. I think it's around uh, 7 minutes if I look into the camera. It's around 7 minutes of video recording or using the Oculus on the Note 5 and the battery is down by 5% and it is running on full uh, maximum brightness. Overall, if this is priced at around 6000 rupees, then it's uh, something really interesting because uh, a very good uh, built product and unlike the Google Cardboard which is not that cool in terms of using it this is something interesting and if it's priced around 6 to 7 thousand rupees I would recommend you to go for it and this would be launched in India on 20th of this month so that's when this video would go live of course and uh, this is something you should actually check out this is the Oculus uh, VR I cannot show you a real demo of uh, what I'm experiencing I'll try to do that through a software uh, but I'm just flying to China right now so I cannot do that at the moment but once I'm back I'll try to do something where you guys can also see what I am actually watching into this and that would be a very interesting way of uh, experiencing the VR by others. So this was the unboxing and hands on of the Samsung Gear VR which is powered with Oculus technology and uh, this was the unboxing and a quick uh, setup of the same. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and stay subscribed to Phone for more. Thank you.